guys welcome back to my channel welcome back to a new video we've got a classic vlog look at that thank you look at that sun that is glorious yesterday was well it's wow am i okay it's tuesday today it's the two like hottest days you would have seen the uk literally going into meltdown about it it's actually a bit embarrassing that we can't cope with like any temperature that's slightly too cold or any temperature that's slightly too hot like we all go into meltdown don't we so it's currently tuesday it's supposed to get to let me actually just look it's supposed to get to 37 degrees by three o'clock today it's a red warning there's actually an exclamation mark in a triangle saying warning on my Met Office app right now. However, it's currently five to nine. It's already, well, it says it's 26 degrees on my phone. It says it's 26 degrees on the car, but it's quite like cloudy, so it's not too bad. Um, I've just actually came to the Metro Centre. If you are in North East Galley, then you'll know, you'll know it well. Um, to get my toenails done, and I need to get my sister a birthday present. I was meant to go to London yesterday, um for work and then i was gonna get her a present while i was there but honestly the thought of sitting on a train and being in london in this weather was just an absolute fat hell no from me um so i've came to the metro and i'm hoping to get her something because there's been a new harrods beauty which has opened here um oh that's a bit better isn't it sorry about this lighting guys um so i'm hoping to get her something from there i also need to get my toenails done because they're currently a hot mess and I thought I'd just bring you along for a few days, really. I'm just using the iconic London lip oil, which honestly is the best thing ever, especially on no makeup days like today, to just, like, I don't know, give you, like, a little something. Well, that that's good, isn't it? There, you can kind of see. Um, so I think I'm going to probably vlog over a few days because this is my plans today, met raw, and then I'm going to just do a bit of work when I get home before it gets too hot and then I'm going to enjoy the sun because my motto in life is that when we get hot weather in the UK, you've got to just enjoy it. Like, it's a rarity. You've got to enjoy it when you can. Um, and then I've got just some work to do and then I think on Thursday, me and Sophie are going to go to Newcastle shopping because she needs a bag and shoes for ladies day because we're going to ladies day on saturday it's sophie's 21st on sunday so me and my mum are going to be setting up the garden and i thought i'd just do a nice little spend a few days with me vlog and you can see a little bit of my life living back in the northeast which i mean i don't need i don't think i need to stress anymore how much i'm just loving life like i absolutely just love living here so much it's just great so yeah no makeup day today because i quite frankly couldn't think of anything worse than putting makeup on in this sticky heat hair is in a sleek bun well it's in like a claw clip bun um got this little fendi skims bodysuit on denim shorts um and we're ready to go the metro opens in three minutes i'm here for opening because i'm hoping i can get in the nail shop before it gets busy trying out new nail shops that's another thing guys like obviously now i've moved i've got to find a new nail lady i've got to find a new brow lady you all know how much i absolutely love rachel who does my brows oh god it's actually stressful being a girl isn't it um but yeah thankfully i got my nails done before i left so these don't need doing for quite a while what's that black on my finger um but my toenails were in desperate need so First stop is nail shop, and then I'm very excited to look around the new Harrods Beauty, and I need to find Sophie a present. Wish me luck. He's a bit of a nervous, anxious boy. Good boy. Had my toenails done, everybody. How are you all keeping cool today? 
Are we all drinking plenty of water and keep them cool? Great. So I've just got back from the Met Raw. Honestly, guys, I literally use this air fryer all the time. Like, it is just what I use to cook everything now. I've just popped in some of these Linda McCartney burgers. They are incredible. So these mozzarella ones are my fave. They're lush. And then this one I haven't tried yet, but Jordan tried it yesterday. He didn't really like it, but I'm going to try it today to see how I like it. Slice of cheese, Warburton's thin, and then some salad, which I made last night, which I'm just going to have on the side because Jordan's having two burgers. Um, and that's going to be lunch. Plenty water because, honestly, it is so hot out there i'm gonna make this and enjoy it in the garden i also got this burger sauce which actually tastes like big mac so i mean this little like healthy take on a burger in the sun is a dream cheese has been added honestly the air fryer is a game changer So you didn't like the chicken one, did you not? You try it. Right. I oh will. I'll give you these two instead. Every change has a reason. Baby, let it come to you. Every soul, every season lives outside of status quo. So this feels really weird, but when I've been styling my hair recently and doing like curls in it, in the middle part and I just feel like it looks flat. So I've put it in a side part and Sophie says it looks nice. Let me know what you think. Um, but I'm just going to give you a little haul of some of the things that I picked up the other day. Let me start with Primark because this is from Primark, but it's in the wrong bag. First thing first, I've got a strapless bra to go with... <laughs> guys sophie's what? still sophie's still getting used to the fact that i talk to the camera constantly no i'm just i've just woke up five minutes ago and then she, I just woke up. Away. she just woke up she was on night shift last night and we're off to get half price sushi at avika so it's a win-win basically got a strapless bra because my dress for ladies day is strapless and i felt like i needed um a bra with it and then got two pairs of shoes from Primark because I wanted to try them on with my dress 
um, and see which ones I preferred. But then I ended up getting some shoes from Zara anyway. So both of these I think I'm going to return. Um, or I might keep them just... I don't know. I haven't decided yet. So these were the first pair. Just white little block heel pair specs over the top. I think they look quite expensive and they were only £10. So I might just keep them because I think they're quite a good summer shoe. Like with like jeans or a dress for like daytime when you don't want a big heel. Um, I then got these ones which again very similar vibe purse back heel thing over the front and they've got a strap around these ones were 14 pound um do you want these actually because i was going to let you and mam try them on before mm -hmm. i return them i feel like they're quite a u heel yeah because i got well this is what i thought because i got these and then i also got these from Zara, so they're very similar. But I prefer the Zara ones. They're so comfortable. I've seen loads of people rave that these are a really comfortable heel. What ones do you wear? I'm gonna wear these Zara ones. So if you don't want them, I'm gonna take them back. Yeah, I'll try them on. Do you want to try them on? Yeah, please. Okay, cool. Um, so they're either going to Sophie or getting took back. And then, like I said, I got these from Zara. So I'd seen a few people say these were a really comfortable heel. And I don't have just a neutral heel because my ones that I did have like looked a bit scruffy so I took them away. Um, but I just think they're really nice and honestly they feel so comfortable. I'll report back how they feel after a full day of wearing them. Um, but from trying them on, they're unreal. These were 32 99 got them in my usual size which is a 5. And then also from Zara I got this bag which honestly is gorgeous. It's like that classic Zara shape. Um, which I've got the green bag but it's got this like square detail on it. I need to take the plastic off and then it's almost like a knitted material this looks really nice with the fascinator that I'm wearing for ladies day and then these shoes and the dress and the bag was 49.99 um a bit conscious of it getting like makeup on it but I'm sure it'll be fine it's cute nevertheless so I'm just waiting for Sophie to get ready and then we are going to head through to Newcastle. We're going to go for um, sushi at Avika because they've got this like thing on this afternoon slash tonight which is like half price sushi and cocktails. So we're making the most of that because Sophie is now officially off work for her birthday. So we're starting the celebrations early and she needs to pop to a few shops as well. So yeah, let me show you my outfit. But I'm excited. Okay, outfit of the day. Apologies about the dirty mirror and the lighting. I've got my oversized naked blazer on. This is such a good oversized, like boxy boyfriend fit blazer. Then got this little black slip dress on from Jack Wills. Very, very cute. Look, it's got like a cowl neck. Really love it. Then I've got my. Uh, where are these from then? I saw it first. Yes, I saw it first, little cowboy boots and my little pearl bag, which I'm obsessed with. This is from a little Instagram boutique. I'll leave it linked down below. And then jewellery is all of it lie on, as always. Talk to me nice, talk to me honestly. 